Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be doing a collective haul of all the my favorite pieces that I've gotten since December, like Christmas of last year. I know, that's a really long time. It's like July, it's like almost Christmas again already. But these are like my favorite pieces. So like, it's not everything I bought since December. I don't buy like one piece of clothing. So like, I have more clothes than like this. So don't judge me. But first, so, oops, let me slow down. Let's get started. So, shoes. First pair of shoes are these babies right here. I got them from H&M. I know there's like a expensive -er pair of these, expensive -er. A more expensive pair of shoes that are like these but these were really affordable they're like 24 bucks from from um, H&M I don't know if they still have them but they are my favorite, my favorite. Yes. Right. next pair of shoes I got from Urban Outfitters I was watching them for like ever and then they finally went on sale and I was like yes I have to get them they are these the Alexia boot I like how they have like the placement where shoelaces would go but like instead it's like a zipper because I feel like shoelaces on heels is weird, but the next pair of shoes that I'm going to show you have laces, so I'm just a mess. But these are the Alexia boot. I got these from Urban Outfitters. Like I said, this haul is like of my favorite pieces from December, so I don't know if they still have these, but I'm sure you can find them if you type them in Google. So, yeah. Next pair of shoes I got from Charlotte Russe. Who doesn't love Charlotte Russe? I feel like it's, when it comes to shoes from there, they're like super affordable because you get like one and then like the second pair is half off but i recently went on a cruise back in may so i had to get like a lot of like easy stuff but then in the same sentence like cute stuff so i got these gladiator shoes um if you know me personally i wear these babies all of the time like they make any boring outfit like a little bit more interesting so like go get some gladiator sandals and if you're wearing like a plain white dress and you don't wear any statement necklace you throw on these babies and your outfit is like next these shoes were bought by my boyfriend because he's so great um these steve madden shoes like how Bracken gorgeous are these little children. I love these things. Um, these are, yeah, pretty much my favorite shoe. They go with, like, anything that I tend to wear because I wear a lot of, like, solids. So, like, shoes and necklaces are, like, my statement things. And I know you guys are probably sick of this necklace I wore it in my last video, but it just was, like, laying down and I was like, this stripe needs some, like, needs some, needs some spice in there. Okay. Pace yourself. Like, close your eyes, and then when I say open them, open them to look at these beautiful, beautiful pair of shoes. I don't know what they're called, but I will definitely have them in the description box below. But they are these Jeffrey Campbell freaking cowboy strappy boot things. They are freaking amazing, and my boyfriend bought me these for Christmas last year. Um, I have yet to wear them because, like, I don't want them to get, like, messed up. But I love them. They are so beautiful. So beautiful. So beautiful. And I don't know. I think we got these off of eBay because I was going to get them from Nasty Gal, but they were sold out because he waited too long to buy them. So we found them on eBay. But like I said, I can't remember what they're called right now, but I will have them in the description box below. But these babies are magnificent. I love them so much. And last but not least, these are like the shoes I wear all the time. I don't really like high, high heels. I kind of like heels that I don't look like, you know, one of those people that people record that are like, she doesn't know how to walk in heels. So I don't really go too crazy with like the heels and stuff. But these are my favorite. And they lace, like I said, I didn't really like. But I really like these ones because like you can see like my polish and like my tan skin through these. But they're like, they have a little heel, not too high. I also got these in brown. <laughs> You know, one of those people that, like, you like it in one color, so you get the other color because you like it in that color, too? Like, there's a couple things where I have, like, one item, but I have, like, every color in the item. But, like, these shoes are great because they're not too high, they're not too low, but they're still, like, casual, but not, and kind of like a sandal, but not. So, like, these kind of fit in a different 
amount of groups, but these are my fave. And I got these off of Urban Outfitters too. They're like, I think they're like, um, I think it's Ozzy, it was called. I'm not sure. Yeah, Ozzy. I don't know if that's it, but Ozzy. So there's that. Next, moving on to the clothing. Um, this is literally, I'm going to show you everything I got today, like 4th of July. 2015 and then I'll show you everything I've, ha I've had stop rewind I have one more pair of shoes guys I cannot forget these babies these are life I seen these and we're like yes I have to get these but these are my favorite tennis shoes I'm not really a sneaker person so like I'll wear these on rare occasion but I love these and my feet look really big in the viewfinder but I just wear a size 8 so they're not like clumpy. But I love these. Yes. Okay. Moving along to clothes now. Um, like I said, I'm going to show you everything I bought today. And then I'll go into all the stuff that I have that are my favorites from Christmas up until now. Yes. So I got these jeans from Topshop. They have like a little rip in the knee. Um, they were on sale. Topshop was having a sale, y'all. So go to Topshop. Get some stuff. Because they had a really good sale. Um, these are the, I don't even know if this is a real name, but like Hayden, are these Hayden? Hayden jeans? Don't look at how fat I am. But they are all black, they have a little cuff at the bottom, and they have rips on the knees. The next place I went is Urban Outfitters, because who doesn't love Urban Outfitters and their sale room? Amen. So the first thing I got... Since I've lost weight, there's all of my denim does not fit me. Like, I've literally had to sell it on Poshmark. Oh, so come on, go back on Poshmark and all clothes. Oh, yeah. Anyways, I got these Levi high-waisted shorts, and they're, like, all ripped and distressed and whatnot. Um, they are super cute, and I am, like, obsessed with them. Like, if I could have, if this was my firstborn child, I would treat them with so much love. Just kidding. But... These are amazing, and I like them, and they fit great, and they hug me in all the right places, and they're flattering, and they're great, and I got them from Urban Outfitters. Next thing I got from Urban Outfitters is this little cute crop top. It's so cute. I really like the color. Don't see that I got it on sale. Okay. It's really cute. Like I like how it's like baby blue, and it's not like wham bam in your face. It's just like a subtle color, but it's like kind of, you know, nitty and cute and fun and... I might wear that today, but who knows. That is all I got from Urban Outfitters. Moving right along to Forever 21. I got, literally, I was like walking out. And you know when you see that piece when you're walking out and you're just like, yeah, I have to have it. I seen this plaid crop top. Like, plaid crop top. Why not? Who wouldn't want it? It's great. It buttons. And it matches the shorts I got. Like, hello. Who wouldn't want it? Okay, the next thing I got is another crop top, just a little basic one, like a little red one, cute. Because I was going to get these shoes, but I didn't get them, but like I figured that I really look good in red because it like goes with my skin tone, so I got it anyways, just in case, so yeah. And last but not least, oh my god, it, sorry Levi's, but these freaking shorts make my day. Like, how cute is this pattern, and they have like... Okay, no, they don't. Yep, they do. They have, like, beading that goes down right here, which is really cute. And these are so flattering. Like, I was trying to look for the top, but, you know, Forever 21 is, like, a hot mess. So, like, you can't really find anything that goes with anything. I bet you anything this is, like, a coordinate. But I couldn't find the top, so I just got the shorts. And I will make it work. Because they are fabulous. Okay. Moving on to all the stuff that I've had since December. My favorite pieces. Um, the first pair of shorts I actually bought recently, but, like, we'll just count them as, like, things I bought recently. Um, but they are just a pair of denim blue shorts, high-waisted. Um, I've really been into high-waisted stuff lately. Um, it's been really flattering for me. I still have, like, a little pooch, so I kind of, like, tie a flannel around and, you know, do the whole flannel thing that's really in right now. But they're just plain shorts. The next pair of jeans are my absolute favorite jeans and the only jeans that still fit me since losing weight that I bought in the very beginning are these jeans from Topshop, um, distressed and cuffed and glorious in all their wonder and these are again the Hayden jeans from Topshop. 
These are life. I love these things so friggin' much. It's been, it was so hard for me before um, finding like boyfriend jeans. And then that's literally all I can find now. So, but I still have these. They're staying true, staying strong. Love these. These are my life. I literally wear these with like anything. Like a tank top, a regular top, a dressy top. Like whenever I feel like busting those out. Because you can still dress them up, you know? They're like rippy and like stuff. So yeah. The next thing I just recently got, so it wasn't like I haven't had it since December with like tags on it, is this black crop top. Um, it's like a shell opening in the back kind of. I don't know if you can really see it. My lighting's kind of crazy in here, but it opens in the back. It's really cute. So if I'm wearing like a cool bra, you can kind of see it. Um, so I might wear this with those red shorts. So I just got that. Next thing that I've had is, I got this in two colors, but I'm only showing you the one because the other one's dirty because, like, I wear clothes that I'm supposed to be putting in a video. But I got this black, black? I got this gray, kind of heathery gray crop tank top from Forever 21. It was, like, in their basics. Oh, I still have the tag on it. It's only, like, five bucks. Isn't that great? So, like, I got that. So before my camera decided just to stop working, I got this striped crop top from Forever 21 as well. Like, look at all these stripes right now. Like, these stripes are so unflattering, but, like, I find that, like, in a crop top, like, it kind of works because it's not your whole body. But I don't really look 10 pounds heavier right now, but it's all about the other waist stripes. I don't know what the name of it is. I'm dumb. I'm retarded. But anyways... The next thing I got from Ver 21 is this high neck army greenish um, dress, maxi dress. It's so cute. It's like really fitted and form fitting. Um, comes really high in the neck so I can wear like necklaces and stuff. And then it's just like muscle cut. Um, it's really cute. I wish I would have did like a try on haul. I'll have to do that in my next one. I'm not, I'm not an expert yet guys. So once I figure it out, I'll let you know. And the next thing I got... I can't remember what store I got this from to save my life because it was one of those stores in the mall that doesn't really have like a name but it has like all those like cute single pieces. You know what I'm talking about? Like when you go in there you're like, oh they have a cute bra or like, oh they have a cute kimono but it's not like a name brand store like some place that you could go back to and then like the next day it's out of business, you know, like kind of like a Rapsodel or something. I, I don't know where I'm going with this. But I got this in the color black and white. It's just a bralette with like a sporty stripe at the bottom so you can call it whatever I don't care I don't know but I got this in white also I didn't really feel like I should show you each color that I got stuff in because it looks exactly the same so yeah so I got this shirt from Rapsodel just a high neck top and it quarter sleeve kind of comes down almost to the elbow um, I got this in black as well um, for work because like I have piercings here and like it really helps when I have like high neck tops to wear necklaces because it's not like right on my piercings. Like had I been in a tank top I would not be wearing this right now because my, my dermals would be all over the place. They'd be rejecting left and right. They would be, they'd be gone and I just can't do that. So moving right along. And the next thing I got for vacation is this Victoria's Secret oversized apparently uh, hoodie. Nice and loose, beachy, really thin, really soft. Um, this is like horrible. But it's really great and it was like really low cut. It has like the cut in the front that's not like right way up on your neck like choking you. So that's really neat. So I got that. I love it. The next thing I got, I actually wore this to the airport before I went on vacation. Looking like a highlighter. But it was actually really cute and it has like this silver detailing which is really cute. And I wore it with like a pair of bike shorts and it was like the best day of my life. I was so comfortable. But anyways, it's Victoria's Secret, lime green, looking like a goddamn street cone. Excuse me for causing, I'm sorry. <laughs> but it's really cute, super cute, super cute, super cute. So I wore that to the airport. And I'm so sorry for the lighting. It keeps going in and out. I don't know if you've seen like the true color of that, but it was great. Next thing I got that I still haven't worn yet are these sweatpants that are super cute. They kind of like hug your ankles at the bottom, kind of like joggers. Well, I think they are joggers, but yeah, you know, fake pop rock in the fake pockets in the back and whatnot. But those are really cute. 
have yet to wear these because I'm a horrible person. Uh, next, I got a couple things from uh, Windsor that I'm going to show you, and then I'll go into some other things. Um, the first pair of thing, first thing I got are these shorts. Like, how cute is that? They have like the ruffles at the bottom, but like my butt is kind of big, kind of big, kind of. So like the little ruffles stick out in the back and it looks like I have like a shade over my legs. But they're really cute. They're like a suede material. Um, I really like them. I enjoy them. They're fun. And I have yet to wear them though because I just love stuff with tacks. So yeah. Next thing I got from Windsor, I have worn and I've yet to wash. So please excuse like the little bit of deodorant you will see on this shortly. Um, it is a halter top, black, netted, knitted, 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 um, but it's a black knitted halter top, and it's really hard to hold this up so you can, like, see, but it's, like, haltery, and it has, like, straps that hold you up at the top, you know, hold the bubs in place, but it's really cute, it's really comfy, really flattering, and I love it so freaking much. I have yet to find the perfect bra to go with it, though, which is really irritating because I don't want to have, like, straps, but... I need that lift, you know. Next thing I got is from Topshop. You know, I'm just back and forth and all over the place. But it was on sale and I got it for vacation. Isn't it so beautiful? It's like 70s-esque. It's so cute. It goes with like a lot of different colors. Like blacks and denims and white. So it like was really cute to wear to the beach and stuff. And then it's just like that in the back. It's high neck also, um, which is really cute. I really like it. It's like my favorite. Right. The next thing I got is from Urban Outfitters again. That sale rack. Just be getting me dough. Got these blue denim high-waisted shorts. Really royal blue. They're Levi's also. And these aren't my favorite at the moment, but like I'm starting to like get into them, you know? You know when you like have something in your closet and you don't really like it at initial purchase, but like six months later it's like, oh my god, I did not know I had this. Like so this is one of those items because like I didn't really like it at first but now I like them so yeah the next thing I got is like really immature of me well not immature like clothing isn't immature but I seen it and I was like I have to have that because like that one episode just made me like love him so much and I'm sure you all know what episode I'm talking about I'm not gonna even try to sing it because I can't master it but that pizza episode Spongebob it, where he is freaking singing his heart out to deliver that pizza it just made me get this crop top and it's really colorful and I love tie-dye and it looks really big on this screen but it is magnificent and I love it so much it's just plain in the back but he is ready he's ready I love this going back to Topshop I got a pair of I don't even know if these are the names but it's lay lay jeans lay I don't know they're wrinkled and that's annoying but they have rips in the knees they are petite so they fit me wonderfully they go right in my ankles so I can wear like heels with these which is awesome but they have little rips in the knees they're a light wash they're really thin really stretchy really comfy they're absolutely great in all of their glory and all of their perfectness and I love Topshop jeans I love Topshop jeans so Topshop if you happen to be watching, I love your jeans. Bring them to me. Give them to me. I love them. I will wear them. Going back to Forever 21, I got this really cute mesh-esque dress bathing suit cover, whatever you want it to be, because it's mesh and it's super cute and I love it so very much because it's black, so that's a good buy. Alright, jumping right back into Topshop. <laughs> We got us uh, some, I had to buckle them, shorts. These are the cutest freaking shorts you'll ever see. Just kidding. They're really cute, really flattering. I love them so much. Um, I, don't, I still can't determine whether they're blue or whether they're black. Um, I think they're like a really deep blue though because every time I wear black with them, it doesn't match. But I've only washed them once. So if they fade that quickly, then, you know, that's just the problem that they have. It is not... We are so far from this season, but I bought these, like, in December. But they are, like, windbreaker-type Victoria's Secret jackets. Um, they were super cute, and I was like, I'm definitely going to get these because sometimes you hate, like, 
really heavy jackets and you just want like something light you know you don't really want it to be too overwhelming so then I got the pink one too because like oh my god it's a match but I showed you this one because this one's different the black one doesn't have the pink going right here so that's the only reason why I showed you these different and it doesn't have the pink on the sleeve so yeah that's how I can justify showing you this one but it has the pink on the back super cute nice and windbreakery and if you're wearing headphones I'm really sorry because that was really loud but now I'm gonna move these over there all right next um i have this store in las vegas called rapswoodell i don't know if it's anywhere else it could be but i just don't know so like if you have it where you live this is where i got these from um rapswoodell um these high-waisted red shorts super super comfy and super super flattering oh my goodness i tried these on and i was like they fit like a glove like and they're dressy they could be casual like tuck any kind of shirt in here and you're like in business and it's just great and they are perfect i love these next from forever 21 um initially when i first started losing weight it was really hard for me to find a crop top i really wanted to like get into them so i ended up finding a couple in the plus size section which is which was really cool because i do have bigger boobs so like i found that crop tops as i was losing weight like my boobs would, like, lift the crop top up, like, another three feet, and, like, you could see, like, the bottom of my boobs, which was weird. So, I found these, a couple striped ones. Like I said, I got them in a couple colors, so I'm not going to show you the same ones. You don't see it twice, but this one's black and white, long sleeve, which is really cool, but it's really thin. So, like, I could get away with wearing it now, simply because it's a crop top and I'd wear it with shorts, but it's super cute. Um, and I got this in the plus section, so if you have bigger boobs, know that... It is not anything to be ashamed of buying a plus size top. It's not anything to be ashamed of, period. Buy clothes where they fit because you need to buy clothes that fit. Don't buy them all tight. Wear your clothes. Be proud of your size, girl. Be proud of it. Anyways, moving on. Next piece I got from Forever 21. Um, I probably should have tried this on instead of buying it online because it's way too big. But it is a crop knitted, crop, knitted crop top. With some fringe on the bottom so it's a little less spicy you know but it's super cute i might wear this today i don't know can't decide i don't know but it's super cute and i like the little fringiness at the bottom and that it's see-through because you can wear a really cute you can wear a really cute bralette and this will you'll be able to see it i'm itching my chin like i have chin hairs next from forever 21 i got this really cute romper it's like i feel like it's like that gray that was maybe like washed way too many times but it came this way but it's a really cute romper um i love it it doesn't have pockets or anything so you're kind of like screwed if you have to hold something but it has like button detail in the back that'll close y'all up Ooh, sorry that's really cute couple more items left and then I will get out of your hair next we have a pair of patterned joggers I got these from Rapsodale as well they're really baggy really flowy and then they hug your ankles at the bottom so you go wear cute shoes but they're super cute and I'm really into patterns now like patterns and solids I'm sure a million other people are because I'm so like basic but you know Next thing I got on vacation, um, I had been looking for one of these everywhere. I know you can find them on dimepiece.com, but like it was a triple the price of how much I got this one for. On my cruise, I actually went to Jamaica. So what better place to get a dashiki than in Jamaica? It is super freaking cute and super freaking amazing and I love it so freaking much because look at those pockets, look at that pattern, look at this color, look at my tan. Just kidding, I kind of lost my tan, but... I think I still kind of have it but anyways this is a glorious piece of clothing it could be like a dress well I wore it as a dress or like a bathing suit cover is what I wore it for but these things are amazing and they're so comfy and it's so great and I got it from Jamaica and it's like my favorite piece ever. I love it so much. that's all the clothes that I have purchased um, I'm so sorry if I was all over the place and I should have been more organized with putting like stores together but like I had this mountain of clothes that I was like dying to show you guys and I was like I'm just gonna put it in a haul and like just go with it. So now I actually have like 
a couple more items that are actually like all from the same store. So I got y'all. So Bath and Body Works had a freaking sale and I got some lotion because I don't want to be ashy, but they smell so good. I got the Peach Bellini and the Beach Coconut. Um, I got another one, but I've used like half of it and I thought that'd be really ratchet to show like a half used bottle, but it's like the blue one. I don't know what it's called, but I got these two. It smells so good. Let me smell them for you. It smells so good. Yep. If you're going to the sale, purchase these because these two smell like vacation in a bottle. So there's that. Next, I got this candle that is burning. This one's Island Waters. And I also got, oh, you know, I love anything that smells like a man. You know that. You heard that in my last video. But this freaking white sand freaking candle smells like freaking amazingness. Like, if you are having a bad day, you smell this candle. It smells like freaking, like life is going to be good. Because it smells so good. It smells so good. It literally gives me chills. Can you see my chills? Can you see my chills? I literally have chills. My hair is rising. I have chills. Because this candle smells so good. I got like three of these, so... These will be burning in my home if you visit. And the next one, because I'm so freaking basic, I got black teakwood. This one smells great, but not as great as that one. But this one smells like... This one smells great. It smells so good. It's so good. So... I highly, highly, highly recommend. I know, like, my word isn't God, but, like, if you are having a bad day, just go into Bath and Body Works and smell white sand beaches or a black teak wood, and girl, boy, anybody watching this, you will just feel amazing. It just smells so good. It smells so good. So good. All right, and the last thing that I'm going to show you is my absolute favorite, favorite, favorite thing that I recently purchased. Well worth the money. So worth it. Would buy again. Did buy again. Currently have a pending order. Are these sunglasses from Key, per, spelt Q-U-A-Y, which really confuses me because I always, always want to be like, yeah, they're from Quay, but it's Key. Everyone has purchased off of this site that I've seen because I'm just a basic female but these ones are my favorite um I haven't seen many people with these I've seen them on their Instagram and stuff but I don't I think more people get like the other ones that have just came out but these are my freaking favorite they're the on the proud glasses I love how they're like mirrored so like you can't see into my soul when I'm wearing the glasses I'm like so tacky right now I'm wearing green black and silver got some gold got some black and white I'm just a hot mess but these are my favorite sunglasses. They're from Key. You should get them because they're great. Yes. Can we Vogue for a minute? Is this Voguing even? Or am I just like doing shit with my hands? Anyways, these are amazing. They're from Key. And that is the last favorite thing that I have. So, that is it, guys. I don't know why I keep talking with this really weird accent. So, excuse me. I'm, it's just the 4th of July and I'm just like... All excited for fireworks! So, leave comments down below on videos you want to see next on my channel. I really hope you enjoyed this video. I thought I'd throw another haul in there for you guys because I'm really good at them and I buy stuff a lot. So, I thought that I'd show you guys. And I bought a lot of crap over the last few months and junk. So, I thought I'd show you. So, again, thanks so much for watching and thank you, thank you, thank you so much to those recent subscribers and the ones that were already there, but thank you so much for taking the time to subscribe and enjoying the videos that I posted so far. I hope you stay subscribed and enjoy my future videos, but please do leave comments on videos you want to see next on my channel. Um, I like, I like making videos, so, you know, yeah, so... Um, I'm gonna go now because it's the 4th of July and I'm just sitting in my room by myself so thank you so much for watching have a wonderful weekend and however you choose to celebrate swimming family barbecuing watching Orange is the New Black I hope you have a wonderful 4th of July bye oh and go follow my snapchat so you can see more of this face right here I'll leave it right here on the screen on the screen it smells so dang good